way, only way. They gon' know my name until it fade away. Fade away. Alright, what is going on guys? It's Mark here and today I'm gonna talk to you guys about uh, the Awakening DLC which is coming out in less than a week's time. So yeah, let's get right into the multiplayer maps right quick. So Skyjacked, everybody knows it's a remake of Hijack from Black Ops 2. And it looks like amazing. It looks like exactly the same, except for the parts on the side where like it was like a little walkway. Uh, I guess they they blew up the middle part. There's like a hole in the middle of the ship, so you can like go straight from the side into the bottom of the middle of the ship. And yeah, the map pretty much looks the same, but I guess it's gonna play out the same. I don't think there's gonna be a mu as much wall run spots as other maps. So yeah, Skyjack looks amazing. Uh, Rise. Like, as soon as I saw Rise in the trailer, I thought of Silo instantly from Black Ops 1. I don't know, something about it just looks the same. Like, I remember in Silo, there was, like, a thing in the middle, like, um, I don't know what it was, like, a circular thing. And I'm looking at the picture right now, and that's what I see. And those little, um, concrete cylinder things, I think that was in there, too. So, yeah, Rise, it looks like a Silo remake. I'm not sure it might be. Uh, Splash. Splash looks like so nice. It's so colorful and everything. I think it's gonna be like Grind. Uh, I hope it turns out to be like Grind because Grind was like one of the best maps in Black Ops 2. Uh, also for feeding too, because uh, the Grind spawn trap was real. <laughs> that was like one of the best spawn traps. So yeah, I'm really excited to play Splash. I'm, I'm guessing right now Splash is gonna be like one of the best maps in the DLC. Uh, Gauntlet, a lot of people were saying that it was gonna be a free run map, which I was like really like, uh, I really didn't want it to be free run map. Like, why would it? Why would they make free run maps in the DLC for the season pass? Like, that would be pretty stupid because I I don't want no free run maps. I don't play free run, and uh, if they did make it into a free run map, that would be like really dumb. So it's cool that they made it into like um three lane map and like different sections and are different like freaking climbing zones. That's pretty cool. Um, I hope it doesn't turn out to be anything like freaking uh. A map like drone or something inside of a facility which it is inside of a building but I hope it doesn't turn out really shitty uh, some people were saying it's gonna be like raid I don't think it's gonna be like raid with three lanes uh, yeah so those are the multiplayer maps I hope that these multiplayer maps are like the classic Call of Duty maps like uh, with like just three lane maps because these maps in Black Ops 3 are horrible like there's only like a couple good maps uh, combine is good but uh, I know all of you guys have noticed this, but in all the multiplayer maps in Black Ops 3, there's nothing but head glitches every quarter. And I know why they did this. They did this for the MLG people, for the league and all that shit. And yeah, it's just really annoying just playing against people on these maps because every corner there's a head glitch. And yeah, I, I think they said in the trailer they're gonna, they want to go back to traditional Call of Duty maps. Uh, I hope they do, and I hope they're not just bullshitting us, but... Well, yeah, we'll, we'll have to wait and see because I just hope they don't put head glitches around every corner on these maps because that would actually fucking suck. So, yeah, let's get right into the zombies. So, their Ice and Dragon looks fucking amazing. Like, uh, it looks like a Mob of the Dead style map because, you know, it's all dark and stuff, snowy and like thunder and stuff. It looks crazy. Uh, there's specialist weapons which look amazing too. Looks like it's going to be a lot of fun playing zombies with those. But, um,. The map itself, it looks complicated as hell. Like, it's gonna be a lot of Easter eggs and stuff, like, to do. Which I really am not a big fan of. I like the traditional Call of Duty zombies, like, um, Ascension. That was my favorite map, like, ever, I think, in zombies. Ascension, Moon, Kino, they're towing. Uh, I like Buried from Black Ops 2, Mob of the Dead 2. I like those maps because you really didn't have to do a lot, like, in order to advance. Like, in these new maps, you have to do so much. Like, you have to do these rituals, build stuff. Uh, you just gotta do a lot. And you gotta put a lot of time into zombies to be, like, good at it. And I understand why they did this. Because as zombies players, like, if you're a strictly zombies player, of course you're gonna want more content and more stuff to do. And, like, just more intricacy. And I understand why they did this. So, yeah, they just, like, um, they want the zombies to be its own mode. Like, zombies is so intricate and detailed. At this point that it could be its own game like Treyarch could make like um just zombies on their own zombies game people would want to buy it so yeah that's why they did that and and yeah i understand that if you want to get good at zombies you're gonna have to play it a lot and learn all that stuff 
but I just don't feel like doing that. Like, I don't feel like putting a lot of time into that because I put most of my time on Call of Duty into multiplayer. I don't play zombies a lot anymore. Like, I used to in Black Ops 1 just play zombies a lot, like Ascension, uh, as I said before. That was my favorite map because you really didn't have to do a lot. And it was just pretty, like, fucking casual and chill. And yeah, that's why I used to love zombies, but I'm not a big zombies fan anymore, but I still play it every now and then. Alright guys, I was gonna wrap it up for the DLC. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed. And make sure to be on the lookout for some DLC videos when the DLC does launch. And subscribe if you are new, and if you didn't enjoy it, refresh it, give it another chance, and peace out.